Happening right now, a longtime member of the community is being remembered. Kim Reeves recently died from breast cancer. And right now, a group is celebrating the life she lived. WNCT's Kara Gann is at the event with more on how her family and friends are remembering her life. Kara. Ken Shayla, I'm here at Tiebreakers, and tonight we're honoring the life of Kim Reeves, a longtime resident of Greenville. And I'm here joined by her husband, Brian Medor. And Brian works with ECU Athletics now, but he used to be one of us at Channel 9. And uh, Brian, tonight we're honoring the life and legacy that your life that your wife left um, here with us. And go ahead and tell me a little bit, what does this night mean for you? And what does it mean to see the community and your all of your friends and family members of Greenville come together uh, for this cause? It really is. A, it, this community is amazing, and when someone's down, they always seem to step up. And no matter what the cause or the reason, this community comes together and lifts people. And Kim and I have been a part of this community for almost 30 years, and she was like that. She was the one pulling me in. I worked with you guys at Channel 9 for years in sports with Brian Bailey, and so she was always the one pulling me to events to do things. So it's wonderful to see it come back around on her tonight and to bring awareness to that terrible disease and some of the causes that she was really big for. Absolutely. And tonight we have different raffles going on. There are sports memorabilia from ECU, NFL sign memorabilia, and all of that is going to be helping uh, Brian and his family pay for some of these expensive medical expenses, and also it's going to be going to Relay for Life, which is an organization that Kim really advocated for. Why was Relay for Life such an important organization for her? Because they were big for her in the beginning when she first started getting sick, and it's hard to go through that. She had a great support system of family. They were there for her, and she thought, what way could I pay it forward to the next person who gets diagnosed? This is the worst thing you can hear in the world when you're, when you're diagnosed with something like that. And uh, for these people to be out here tonight to help her and support what she was so big for, it's pretty big. It's, it's amazing. The turnout's fantastic. Absolutely, absolutely. Well, we're going to be out here at Tiebreakers until 9 o'clock, so you have a few more hours to come out and support this event, support a great woman and a great family, and also a great cause. Live in Greenville, Kerrigan, 9 on your side.